Hello, welcome back. Happy New Year. Sun Lane Fly a lot. Uh, it's been a great couple days for me for 2020. I hope for you as well. Um, got a lot of big plans for this year. So today, for this stream, we're going to finish Ling's Story 1, which would be chapters 8, 9, and 10. Um, and then in subsequent weeks, we're going to keep plowing along with new material, uh, looking to do some more edited video content, perhaps do some additional streams throughout the week. Uh, so kind of the sky's the limit in terms of what we're going to do this year. If you have any ideas at all for things you want to see, whether it be uh, beginner Cantonese content, intermediate, advanced, etc., let me know and we'll make sure to get some of that out there for you. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first thing I wanted to show was just that we have a decent amount of uh, content we're going to be getting through this year. My plan is that uh, we're going to get through most of the Cantonese uh, Learning Center content, the CLC content that we've been working on so far. So we've got a whole plan that brings us through middle of, next, uh, middle of this year. Um, and like I said, there's a bunch of other things that we could be doing as well. So I'm going to look to put out some more content throughout the year, some different videos and live streams. Um, maybe some uh, reactions to YouTube videos. So I'm, I'm pretty excited for this year, but I wanted to show you that we've got a, a pretty good list of things that if you're following along, we'll make some pretty good headway uh, in terms of Cantonese studying together. Uh, one thing I wanted to say too is in terms of between last week and this week, uh, it was pretty productive for me. I, I started doing some uh, Glossica Cantonese review, which if you haven't looked into Glossica, take a look online, see what you think. It's basically uh, just large numbers of sentences with native speaker audio content. And so I've been finding it pretty useful, particularly for just getting a lot of repetition with uh, native speaker cadence and speed and accent and tone. Uh, it's really useful, I think, for kind of imitating uh, the native speaker and getting that rhythm, that flow. So that's a pretty interesting one. I'm not sure if we'll do that on any stream or not, but maybe in a future stream I'll at least show you what the content looks like. Uh, but for now, for today, we're going to finish up Ling's Stories 1, which is pretty exciting. So uh, let me pull that content up. So where we, we left off last week, we were talking about chapter 7 and 8, which were the hot, or actually it was uh, chapter 6 and 7, which were the snacks, the food that mom cooks, um, and then the hobbies. So today we're going to go through uh, 8, 9, and 10, which are family members' hobbies, uh, Ling's good friend, and boyfriend. So just like always, we're going to quickly go through the previous week's chapters and just listen to them once as a refresher. So we'll start with chapter 6, which begins right here. Dai六方,妈咪煮的也,我的屋企人都好中意食菜,所以妈咪会煮好多菜给我的食,好似有菜心,白菜,西兰花感。以豬肉、牛肉和雞,我們都會吃,但是不會吃很多,另外,媽咪會成日煲湯給我們飲,好似豬骨湯、椰子煲雞湯,西洋菜湯和番茄薯仔湯,我都很喜歡飲。如果家
and I think this is the same yin as in dong yin, which means of course, but let's double check that. Absolutely only natural, of course. So that looks like the same yin. So it's got the four slashes on the bottom, and left and right, versus so yin. Not sure, can I copy paste this? Nope. Yeah, so it won't copy-paste, but it looks like it's the same character. Okay, so then moving on to chapter 7. Dai 星期六下晝,我會同同事或者朋友一起去打羽毛球,打保齡,唱卡拉OK,落Disco,或者睇戲。我都喜歡行山,所以有時星期日會同啲舊同學一起去,通常每一次都是行兩三個鐘度,唔會行得太耐。So that was the one that was all about the singers and actors that they liked, and the various hobbies and things that uh, she would do with her friends or co-workers. Okay, great. So that one... That was the one last week that I remember had a lot of proper nouns and names of people, so it was a little bit difficult in the middle there, but uh, we got through it okay. So then moving on to Unit 8, my family members' hobbies. So, okay, yan gesi ho. So let's go through vocab first. Part 1 is gong jia, work. I remember this from uh, another dialogue that this also is like the working of something, like a gear, I think. Si gan, time. Ho chang, very long. Mo mut, not have much. Duck beat, particular, special. See all hobbies. Jing hai only. Yao si. Sometimes. Yup bin. Doing or while doing. Tai. Watch. So like look or watch. Not like a wristwatch. <laughs> um, Dean si. TV. Yum. Drink, be zhao, beer, leng oi, besides, tai bo zi, tai bo zi, read newspaper. Part two is zik, um, weave or knit. So that's, that's a new one for me. I don't, I've never heard of that one. Uh, lang sam. Sweater. So sam here is clothes, and lang is uh, cool, as in cool temperature. So it's like cold weather clothes, basically. Zhong fa to plant flowers. Excuse me, plant flowers. Got lei up, next door neighbor. That's brand new to me. I've never heard got lei before. Si nai, married woman, king gai, to chat, have a conversation. Da ma jart, play mahjong. Do ma, 
horse gambling. So do is the verb for gamble, and you can put. Uh, I, I remember this from Teach Yourself. There's a, a number of different examples of gambling they have where it's do gao for like dog racing, do ma for horse racing, and a couple other examples. So I think do by itself is the gambling part. Dan hai, however, do gamble. Okay, there we go. So gamble, do mui ti, mui ti. Or I guess mui ti, mui ti every time. Yap ba ge sup. One hundred or a several tens. Less than a hundred. Hmm. So that's that's kind of confusing to me. I would think so. Yap ba is one hundred, and then ge sup would be like ten or twenty, some number of tens. So I would interpret that as like somewhere between 100 and 200, like yepak gesa. But this says less than 100, so that's a little confusing. Yek do also. Teng hai fi, playing stereo. Tai assemble. Mo ying, a model. Uh, so it says model train, so like a model or a pattern. Da ge, play computer games, so ge is machine, so this is like hitting the machine. So I would assume that's like a very generic way to say play a video game. Uh, bing bum ba, table tennis, okay. So that one sounds like a... Uh, Basically, that it sound the word sounds like what the sound of the action is for table tennis, hitting the ping pong balls back and forth, bing bum ball. Okay, so so what was this one again? This was oh family members' hobbies. Okay, so that makes sense with that vocab. Um, so let's listen to listen to it without looking at the the writing first. So I need to scroll up here, listen to it once, get a sense of what it is, and then we'll read read it back together. 第八課,屋企人的嗜好。我爹地工作時間好長,佢冇乜特別嗜好,淨係有時一邊睇電視,一邊飲啤酒。另外,佢都好鍾意睇報紙。我媽咪鍾意積冷衫。同种花，有时佢都会同隔篱屋啲师奶倾偈同打麻雀。我大佬中意赌马，但系佢唔会赌好多钱，每次净系赌一百几十。佢亦都好中意听hi-fi同埋砌模型。我细佬就好中意打机
誒，淨係有時一邊睇電視。So only sometimes、uh, watches TV. 一邊飲啤酒 ，and、uh, drinks beer at the same time. 另外，佢都好中意睇報紙 ，and so besides that he likes to read the newspaper. 我媽咪中意中意織冷衫同種花 ，so she likes raising plants. 有時佢都會同隔離屋啲師奶師奶 ，so the married woman next door. 傾偈同打麻雀。我大佬中意賭馬，但係佢唔會賭好多錢，每次淨係賭一百幾十。The gambling。佢亦都好中意聽 HiFi 同埋砌模型。Oh, so that's the Thai. So assembling models. He likes to put together model cars, or I, I guess just models. It says. 我細佬就好中意打機同埋打乒乓波 Okay, so it makes more sense. I got a little tripped up about the beginning here. I think I was just warming up to listening and kind of, I wasn't. There's a lot of new words there in a row, so I, I got a little bit lost. The rest of this isn't too bad, so let's listen to that one more time. 第八课，屋企人嘅嗜好。我爹哋工作时间好长，佢冇乜特别嗜好，净系有时一边睇电视一边饮啤酒。另外，佢都好中意睇报纸。Okay, so that first paragraph makes a lot more sense to me. The part I am still a little confused on is the.、Uh, which word was that? The. Yapin. So let, I want to go back up to that. Yapin means. Oh, while doing. Okay. So yet is the number one, and bin as a is sort of like a question word for like bingo, bindo. So yet being means together or while doing. So basically, drinking beer while watching TV. Okay, so that makes sense.、Um, so let's keep listening to the rest of that.、Uh, where am I at here? Here we go. So paragraph two, starting right here, part two. 我妈咪中意织冷衫同种花，有时佢都会同隔篱屋啲师奶。傾偈同打麻雀。我大佬中意賭馬，但係佢唔會賭好多錢，每次淨係賭一百幾十。佢亦都好中意聽 HiFi 同埋砌模型。我細佬就好中意打機同埋打乒乓波。I think the other、uh, word here that's tripping me up a little bit is the 亦都 ，which they said means and。But I, I haven't seen that very much, so that's a bit confusing for me.、Um, where is that word at? Here we go. Yip do means also. I've seen do by itself to mean also or all, but here it's kind of together. Yip do. So just some something else to get familiar with. Okay, so I'm pretty comfortable with that. We'll keep going now. We'll go to chapter nine. So my good friend, 我好朋友，朋友 is a good word to a good phrase to know.、Uh, friend, you'll you'll use that a lot. Okay, so a son, a given name. Literal meaning is coral, so this is like a, an actual name of a person. That must be the good friend. Jung Ha, middle school. Tong Ha, schoolmate. Jung Yat, form one. Gua Zhen, at that time or at that time. I think that's probably just an an abbreviated form of 
Gua uh, Zhen Si. I think they're probably interchangeable. Interchangeable. Uh, Tong Ban, same class. So like a classmate, I guess. Or no, maybe, maybe that's the class itself. The same class. Ta, to sit. That's a very common, very common verb. Good to memorize that one. Got lay, next. So this is the same got lay from the next door neighbor in the previous chapter. I'll be interested to see how they use that in this dialogue. I, I kind of thought that that was specific for next door neighbor, but it seems like we can use that in a couple other ways. Yi te, moreover. Mo de, we, yao, additionally. So like a list, you, you'll see this in like a list of things. Yao. Ji hai, to live at or live in. Tong yat. Tong, the same. Tong yat tong, tong yat tong. Uh, that's new to me. I don't, I don't know how to use that one. Dai ha, building. So yi, therefore. Uh, seng yat, always. Okay, okay, home. Jo, to do or to be. So I think Joe is pretty generic. You can use that in a lot of different ways. Gung Fa, homework. Yat Tai, together. One Za, to revise or study. So like if you're a student, you have homework, you're studying for your class, you're, uh, you're one Za, revising. Tai Ding Si, watch TV. Wan to play. Jung mm, form five. But yi graduate. So there's a, another example. That's a pretty specific vocab word. When we get to that in our Anki sessions for flashcard review, we'll probably end up suspending that one because it's it's a little bit too specific for right now. But it's good that we have it here in case we need it at some point. See how afterwards. Yik do also. King din wa to chat or have a conversation on the phone. Han gai window shopping. Tai he watch a movie. Okay, and then finally part three. Yi ga now. Uh, let's see, this is going to be a little difficult. Shin mo gung si, shin mo gung si, shipping company. Shin mo gung si. So gung si, I think we've learned previously that's company. And then I already knew that shin means like, uh, I think shin by itself just means ship, like a boat. If it's the same shin. So... I wish I could copy paste from this, but let's type it here. Shin. Uh, or maybe let's type the English boat. Here we go. So boat or vessel, shin. So there's a how in the bottom right, has the legs character in the top right, versus this one. This might be a bit better to zoom in a little bit more for, for the stream as well, so you can see the characters a little bit better. Um, okay, so yeah, it is the same character. So the mo is the only one. I don't really know what that character is on its own. There's no copy here, so unfortunately I don't think we're going to be able to copy that, but we can look that up later and see what shin mo is. 
Okay, so Shinmo Gongsi Shipping Company. It sort of makes sense together. You've got the ship or boat in company. Uh, Zhou again, which is work. Shinmo Manyun. So we know Manyun is clerk, so shipping clerk makes sense. Danhai, however. Do, the same. You need to. Gaban to work overtime. That kind of makes sense too, I think, because ban, as we learned above, this is like work. I think uh, a lot of times if someone's asking you if you're going to work, they'll say fan gong, which is like return to work. But I think there's another way that's serang ban, which means to go to work. Ban. So here, uh, ga means to add. So ga ban is like adding work, I believe, which would make sense for overtime. Uh, let's double check in uh, the sh the, this other dictionary instead. I go back and forth on these two dictionaries. Sometimes I like one better than the other. It's really just... Uh, your preference. So to work overtime, OT. So ga to increase, add. Right. Kind of makes sense, right? So you're adding to work overtime. Do so, probably or most of. Sinzi, only then. Chut lai, to come out, like come out of hiding or come out of a store. Okay, and I think that's it. Yeah, because the, the content starts here. So we'll listen again and then see what we can catch, and then we'll read it out loud together. 第九課 我好朋友,阿山是我中學同學,中一那陣,我同他同班,他又坐在我隔離,而且我們又住在同一棟大廈,所以我成日去他家裡做功課,我們一起溫習,一起看電視,一起玩。中午畢業之後,我們亦都成
uh, practicing like duck, duck beat, for example, especially. That's kind of what you have to do when you're doing studying is you just need to find material that's kind of appropriate for your level. You want it to be challenging, but you don't want it to be so difficult that it's frustrating. Um, so here, this is a little bit challenging for me. It's interesting. It's kind of fun because I can sort of understand it, but there are definitely words that I, I don't know very well. So, so let's read through it and see how I did. So, asan hai ngo jung ha tong ha. So my middle school, uh, middle school classmate, jung yat ngo zan. So at the time of form one. I'm assuming, by the way, that Form 1 is like a grade, like Form 1 versus Form 5. It's different grades, but I don't know for sure. Um, I think based on the context, it means like a, a grade in school and not like a class period, but I, I, I don't know for sure. Um, so we're in the same class. Oh, so she sits next to her. So that's cool. So got lay. You can use it just generically as next to. That's pretty cool. Oh, same building. That's kind of tricky for me, so I want to look back at that vocab again. Uh, where was it? Tong yat tong. The same, and it's it's a little bit oddly specific because it is just for buildings. It says tong yat tong. There's a lot of uh, high rises and mid rises in Hong Kong, so it makes sense to me that there'd be a lot of specialized vocab for these kinds of, you know, uh, condo buildings and apartment flats and that sort of thing. Uh, so same building. So I sing yet hai kai okay jo gung fa. So she always goes over to the friend's house uh, to do homework. Ngo dai yat cai wan za we revise or practice together. Yat tai tai din si, watch TV. Yat tai wan, and play together. Jung ng ba yi zi hao. Oh, so after Form 5 graduation, Jung ng ba yi zi hao. Ngo de yik do sang yat king din wa, yat tai hai han gai tai hai. So there were three things here as well. So after graduating, they will always talk on the phone, go window shopping, and watch movies together. And then part three. Oh, that's a pretty difficult sentence to pronounce because it has a lot of low falling tones. That's something I have a lot of trouble with is if there are a lot of falling tones in a sentence like that, it's hard to get that kind of up and down. So just more practice. So yi ga kai hai yak gan xin mo gong si zhou xin mo man yun. Dan hai kai gong si yao hou da ye zhou. So the, the company has a lot to do. They're very busy. Sang yat do yu ga ban. So always have to do overtime. So yi, wa de do so. Do hai sing ke luk, wak zhe, sing ke yat, sing zi tut lai wan. So basically only on the weekends, Saturday and Sunday, only then can they, can she come out to play. I wonder what age form five is. If, uh, if she's already working, I would assume Form 5 is like a high school graduation age, but 
I don't know. Okay, so that made a lot more sense. Uh, let's listen to that one again. Tongan 但是他公司有很多事做,成日都要加班,所以我們多數都是星期六或者星期日才出來玩. Yeah, it's pretty good. That made a lot more sense. It always does, after you read through it makes a lot more sense, but I like to do that listening first because you can exercise the listening ear in practice just trying to Trying to focus on listening, that's, I think that's probably the best skill. And for me, it's also one, probably the hardest skill is just listening to a little bit faster speech and trying to uh, really improve your listening comprehension. Because reading, you know, even when, when we get farther along in our practice, you, you can always read at your own pace. You can reread something if you don't understand it. You can read it multiple times. You can read it slow, read it fast. It's really up to you as the reader. But listening, when you're having a conversation with someone, you kind of need to get it right most of the time on the first time. And so that's why I think it's probably, probably the most important skill and uh, can be the most difficult. And I think that's probably the key to, to getting good at a language is if we can just get really good at listening. Um, and, and of course, I think reading backs that up because it helps you build up your vocabulary. So we'll have to see how that goes through time as we spend more time together uh, practicing. Okay, last chapter, and then we'll, done, we'll be done with Ling's Stories 1. I think this has been a pretty good pace. Um, I've been doing the two chapters a week, but I think three is okay as long as we kind of pick up the pace a little bit. So chapter 10, or unit 10, is Ngo Lam Lam Peng Yao. So Lam is boy, uh, Loi is girl, so Loi Peng Yao is girlfriend, Lam Peng Yao is boyfriend. So my boyfriend. Vocab, part one, a sing. Uh, okay, so that's the name. Lam Peng Yao, boyfriend. Giu, called. Ngan Hong, bank. Do is a place. Jo, to work, to do something. Wong Kok, uh, Mong Kok. So that's a neighborhood in Hong Kong. I, I know some friends, some people that live in that area. It's a pretty cool area of Hong Kong. Very busy. It feels, uh, I mean, what little I know about it, it feels like a kind of classic neighborhood, I would say. So it has a lot of older buildings and stuff still. Kei Ta, other. Dai Bo Fun. Dai Bo Fun, most of. So that's that's another one that's brand new to me. I'll be curious to see how that is used in a sentence. Hong Kong Yan, Hong Kong people. Yet uh, Yer, same. So you'll see us, you'll hear a sentence pattern where it's like this thing, Ho Ti, something else. Yet Yer, when it's like comparing something as similar or the same. Duck Han, free. As in, you have uh, free time or time to spare. You're not busy. So opposite of tak han would be mong, busy. Gua zhen, that time. Han gai, window shopping. Pa to, dating, to, or to go on a date. Sik ban, have a meal. Tai he, watch a movie. Pak zhao to, uh, 
sorry, Pak Pa have been dating. So there we just put the the jaw is the past tense, remember, and we're putting that in between the two pak jaw ta. So you could say sik jaw fan to have eaten something in the past tense. Yep, lean. One year. Do more or less. So like approximately. Gao lean. Last year. So here's something where you know, paying attention to the characters and the tones matters. So this is Gao Lin. Basically, it's last year. It means old. The character is old, so it's like old year. So Gao Lin contrasted with Gao Lin, which would be the number nine, and then the year. So nine years. Gao Lin which is nine years, Gao Lin is last year. Yet Ti, one time. Siu Ye Sik, barbecue. Gua Zan, so there's a repeat that time. Uh, sick to know or get to know. Sick is also, it's knowing as in, I think it's also knowing as in a skill. So as a Cantonese learner, you're going to hear uh, something of the effect, something to the effect of lay sick, sick gong, gong dong wa. So sick is to know, lay sick, sick, do you know, gong to speak. Guangdong wa Cantonese. So do you know how to speak Cantonese? Or Sik Tang, do you know can you understand or can you listen? Do you hear it? Gao Tong Ha old schoolmate. So there's the Gao again. Peng Yao friend. Gua Qi that time. Sing Ban the whole group. Uh, that's new to me. So we, we talked about ban and sing. I think is the same sing as in sing yet or sang yet always. But together, I guess it means whole group. Yao doi again. Yart, uh, arrange an appointment. Tut lai, come out. Gei ti, a few times. Ma man. So slowly, this is that, that duplication again we talked about a couple weeks ago where if you double it, double the character, then the second one usually changes to a rising tone. Man, man. So, or like wife or missus. Tai, tai. So the second one tends to rise. that changes its tone. That was definitely confusing to me for a while, but once you know that that's kind of what's going on, it, it makes sense. You don't have to, you know, worry about it too much. This is my first language I've been trying to learn this way, so uh, I'm definitely going through a lot of these pain points, but I think it helps to just not, not get caught up in the details too much and just kind of absorb the language, get some experience with it, get some repetition over and over again, and and just not fret too much about the different details or uncertainty and just kind of enjoy the uncertainty and just keep moving. Okay, Dai Ga, all of us or everyone. Hing Tai, interest. Ho Ti, uh, such as. Yik Do, also. Ho Ho King, very easy to chat. Ho Ho King. Uh, how may later on? Mo uh, gay noi, not very long. Pak ta, to date. Pak ta. And then finally, part three. Doi ngo, treat me. Uh, ho ho, very good. Tin zao, adapt to. Brand new word for me. Never heard of that one. 
中意 to like， 你中唔中中唔中意食 blank？ Do you like to eat this？ 啊，你中唔中意食早餐 ？Do you like to eat breakfast？ 我好中意食早餐。I like to eat breakfast。Um, yun why? So because. That's a really good one to know. You can string multiple sentences together. So this, yun why? Because that. Got that? Feel or think? I think about this thing, or this is how I feel about it. Ho ho zai, very good boy. So like. You know, a grandma or grandparent could be saying that about some kid,、uh, whether it's a grandkid or someone else. Sick in smoke. So I think this is like literally eating smoke. <laughs> so like smoking a cigarette.、Uh, yum zao, to drink wine. Do tin, and gamble. So I don't know if we saw do tin last. Uh, last dialogue, we saw the do ma, do ma, and we saw do.、Uh, do tin is chin tin is just、um, dollars or money, so it's just generic gambling. Okay, and that's it. So I'll scroll away from the dialogue. We'll listen to this and see what we get. 第十课，我男朋友。我男朋友叫阿成，佢喺银行度做。阿成同佢爹哋、妈咪一齐住喺旺角，同其他大部分香港人一样。得闲嗰阵，我哋会行街拍拖、食饭睇戏。我同阿成拍咗拖一年到，我哋系喺旧年一次宵夜食嗰阵识嘅。佢系我一个旧同学嘅朋友。嗰次宵夜食之后。我哋成班朋友又再约出嚟玩咗几次，慢慢我同阿成觉得大家嘅兴趣好似，亦都好好倾。后尾冇几耐，我哋就拍拖。阿成对我好好，好迁就我。我爹哋妈咪亦都好中意佢，因为佢哋觉得阿成好好仔，唔食烟，唔饮酒，亦唔赌钱。Okay, so、uh, first third I was pretty good. I got got a little bit lost at the middle of it.、Uh, she basically said that they,、uh, the name that we said before that that was the boyfriend and that、um, he lives with his parents in Wong Kok. And then after they, or I guess they said she said that they would go out to、uh, shop and eat,、uh, see a movie. And then after they'd been dating approximately one year, something about、uh, not sure something about an old classmate. I don't know if she was saying he's an old classmate or she went out to eat with an old classmate for Celia for barbecue.、Um, and then some somehow it transitioned into Ling saying that her parents. Like him because they they feel that he's a good boy. Basically, he's well behaved. He's like an upstanding citizen. Oh, the other thing was, at the beginning, she said that he works at a bank, so that's what he does for his, his work.、Um, but then they were saying that, yeah. So the parents were saying that、uh, they think he's good because he doesn't smoke, he doesn't gamble, he doesn't drink too much.、Um, she said something about how he treats her well. And I think that's all I got. There was something else at the end there, but I don't quite remember. So I think I got most of it. Let's let's see. 我男朋友叫阿阿阿星 ，or no， 阿星。佢喺银行度做，佢喺银行度做。阿星同佢爹哋妈咪一齐住喺旺角。So that whole section is the boyfriend's name, A Sing. He he works at a bank. Yeah, he lives together with his mom and dad in Wangkok. 同其他大部分香港人一样
Okay, so here I don't know what's going on. So let's read this a little bit more closely. Tong ke ta. So with other dai bo fan, most Hong Kong yan, Hong Kong people, ya yeah, With other, so the same as most other Hong Kong people. Tak han ko zan. So when we have free time, ngo dai wei han gai pak to, pak to. Pak to, yeah, so sik fan tai. So I think she's just saying that just like everyone else, when we have free time, we'll do these things. So we'll go shopping, we'll go on a date, go on a shopping uh, date and eat and go see movies. Okay, so this Dai Bo Fun was really tripping me up there, but makes sense. It's just, you know, new vocab. Ngo Tung A Sing Pak Zo Ta Yat Lin Do. So after we've been dating for approximately one year, Ngo De Hai Hai Gao Lin Yat Chi Yat Chi. Okay, so that's a little complex for me. So, after dating approximately one year, we I have to read the English here. It's a little bit complex to understand. So, one year more or less. In the last year, one time, uh, we went to get barbecue to get to know. Okay. So I don't know if she's, I think she's just saying that in the one year's time, they went once. Okay. So, see you, yeah, sick. So, God's on sick, yeah. So, at the time, we were had a barbecue. Uh, so he's her old school classmate. Okay, so I got that part right. I thought that was where I said I wasn't sure if it was that he was a classmate or she went to <laughs> went to eat with a classmate. But okay, so he's her old classmate. Uh, so after, at that time after we had the barbecue. Um, oh, okay, so she didn't mention a group of friends, but it basically is, I guess, implying that after barbecue they met with a whole group of friends. Range an appointment. Uh, to go out several times. Yeah, that's a little difficult to understand as well. Basically, they just plan to see each other again. Uh, okay. So slowly, uh, myself and a sing are feeling that. Oh, okay. Dai ga ge hing tai ho ti. So all of our interests are similar. They share a lot of interests. Oh, okay. So I've only ever heard dai ga used in like the the greeting, like dai ga ho. So that's something I could say to you guys at the beginning of the video, say Daigaho, so how are you, how are you everyone, how are you guys doing? Uh, so I, I kind of, imp I thought that this was referring to the friends, Daiga, but if you remember what we said a couple weeks ago, we used Ge to link things together, and Daiga, Ge, Hing Tai, so every, every interest so every interest is similar. 
oh, that's pretty cool, uh, but not at all what I thought at, at first what it was. Um, so, how may mo gay noi? So, not that very, uh, not much longer afterwards. Ngo de zao pak ta. Oh, so I think what they're saying is, I think she's saying that basically part two is describing when they first started dating. Because if you remember, there was this section about one year that was confusing. So she was saying, so she said that, we, you know, so we, we've been dating approximately... We've been dating approximately one year. Um, you know, basically one time about a year ago, we had barbecue. And then after... Uh, so he, so she, then she has an aside and says, okay, he's an old classmate of mine. And then at that time after the barbecue, we went with a bunch of friends. Uh, to go have fun several times and then slowly through time as we got to know each other that's when we discovered we had a lot of shared interests okay so that makes a lot more sense okay so then part three us sing dying law ho ho so with regards to me he's very good he basically treats me well Ho Tin Zhao Ngo, very much adapt to me. Tin Zhao, Tin Zhao was adapt to. Okay, so basically, like he's adjusting to her, her temperament or her interests. Ngo Dad Di Ma Mi Yek Do Ho Zhong Yi Kai, so the mom and dad both like him. Yang Wai because. Because I think he's a good boy, like, in implying that he's well-behaved. He's an upstanding individual. Uh, so he doesn't smoke, doesn't drink uh, alcohol, and also doesn't gamble. Okay. Great, so that's the last for Ling's Stories 1. Uh, we'll listen to this one more time, and and then we'll do vocab review. That's awesome. So we got through this in a, you know, a couple weeks worth of streams. So let's listen to that one more time. Thirty-four, <laughs> 阿成和他爹地、媽咪一起住在旺角和其他大部分香港人一樣我和阿成拍了拖一年多我們是在舊年一次宵夜食那陣識的他是我一個舊同學的朋友那次宵夜食之後我們成班朋友又再約出來玩
，同其他大部分香港人一样，得闲嗰阵，我哋会行街、拍拖、食饭、睇戏。Okay, yeah. All right, great. So yeah, that's Ling Stories One.、Um, as I mentioned at the top of the hour, we we're going to continue on to the next CLC story next week, which is let's pull up our plan. So my secret book, which is another one of the short stories, it's、um, I've kind of started to to grade the the material a little bit in terms of how difficult I expect it to be. So this will be another intermediate one, similar difficulty to. Ling's stories one.、Uh, it has ch- it has ten chapters as well. So, I think we'll try to do. Let's see. My plan has us doing two chapters, but we'll see how many we get through. I, I think we might be able to start doing three chapters a week. I think we're we're making pretty good progress at that rate. So, we might pick up the pace a little bit and do three chapters a week. Um. Okay. So let's let's. Close this for now, and then we'll do a couple more minutes of flashcard review, and this one will be done for this week. Okay. Sao Gong Ai. Sao Gong Ai. Don't know that one. Oh, this was the arts and crafts. Sao Gong Ai, okay.、Uh, don't know this one. Kit Guo. Oh, Kit Guo result. Kit Guo, okay. To date, so we just saw that Pak Tao. Oops. Press the wrong button. Okay, so Pak Tao. To put, is this by, or is this die die high? Die high. Say high. Okay. To receive to sow. So. Ah,、uh, is this dumb? Like, I think this is to be accused of a crime or to be at fault. Oh, joy, joy, joy. Okay.、Uh, to teach. So, gao shi or gao gao. Okay.、Uh, Wang ka. We just learned this. So this is Wang ka. Wang ka. Stationary. So this was. Is this mun zi or something mun? Oh, mun gai. Mun gai. Okay. Every day would be mui yat or yat yat. Yat yat. Office worker was the was that the mun yun or is that、um, more of a like a secretary? This is、uh, either Manyun or it's another one that's a Z word. I'm not recalling. Manyun, okay. Manyun. To put Tai Hai. Oh no, Fong. Okay, so this is to let go of, to place. So it's a little bit different. Okay, Fong. Fong. Something Zhong. Zap zhong or just zap zhong to focus. Zap zhong. Zap zhong. I'm going to mark that as again, just because that was pretty much guessing rather than knowing the character. Star or celebrity. This is like、uh, Sing Ming or Ming Sing. Ming Sing. Ming Sing. Okay. Mandarin. Pothongwa. Pothongwa. Evening meal is a man fan. Man fan. So night and then rice, man fan. Evening meal. This is. Chao mai fan. Chao mai fan. Chao mai fan. 
uh, this is either it's not hang which is light it's something to do with air hong empty okay hong hong so empty or too empty okay this is a uh, zing hai this was the one that was uh only i believe zing hai zing hai okay uh this is fa fa tai ham fa tai <laughs> so kind of a specific word but i hear it enough it's something i might as well practice um is this dpu like a check oh gu pu stock certificate gu pu i think i got that one wrong last week as well uh this is a botong it's like to make soup botong yeah okay botong botong um is this jar is this like the small bird yeah jar jar uh is this jifong which was fat excess fat jifong jifong okay and then ji ji yun this was like voluntarily Si yun. So gong nai. So gong nai. So handicraft. This was uh, man. Man gai. Man gai. Okay. To put, to place. Uh, to free. Fong. Fong. Hong. Hong. Oh, okay, so this might be ga, like, or a hot, rather, like, gu hot customer. Uh, so the only one I know is gu hot is customer, which I don't think this is. It could be lai, lai, was it lai hot, something like that, as traveler. Or customer, okay. Gu hot. Okay. Go sing. Go sing was a singer. Go sing. Uh, Wong, like king. Wong. Wong. Okay. Mui yat. Mui yat, every day. Mui yat. Hao sang. Hao sang is a, a, like a kid, right? Young generation. Hao sang. Hao sang. Mui qi. Mui qi. Every time. Pattern or style. Uh, was this the one from... Uh, there's a lot of these synonyms or similar words now. There was the one we learned today, which was... I think Mo Ying. That was more model. This one is... I want to say yarn, something yarn, fire maybe. Oh, style. So the key word here is style. Fun sick. Fun sick. So that's an again. Take a shower. Chong lang. Chong lang. Chong lang. Uh, this is sao xin, which is like first. First of all, sao xin. Sao xin. In the first place. Rice noodles in wide strips. Uh, I think this is ha fun. Yeah. Ha fun. These, this is pretty good. Ask for ha fun when you go out to eat next. You'll be pretty happy. <laughs> it's a good, good dish. Um, something high. So there aren't that many of these. Is it zai? No, it's not zai, zai high. It's just a place. This is something high. Um, don't know. Don't know on that one. Oh, zhen hai. Zhen hai. Oh, I feel silly about that one. That That's a, a really good one to know. Zhen hai. Oh, zhen hai hou tong hua. Oh, zhen hai hou tong hua. I'm 
very hungry. I'm really hungry. The boss. Uh, well, Gingley is manager, but that's not it. I think it's Loban. Oh, bossy. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, so Loban is another way to say boss, but this is like the, the loan word from English. Bossy. Bossy. Okay, we'll mark that as we'll mark that as uh, again, I suppose. Um, is this Chungan like with one's own eyes? Yeah. Chungan. That's a difficult one. There's a Daingan, which I think is kind of like squinting, like looking closely, and then Chungan, which is with one's own eyes, and I always get those confused. Hamburger, loan word, Han Bo Bao, Han Bo Bao, Han Bo Bao. Okay, uh, don't know this one. Bo to repair, Bo. Bo. Okay. Stir fry noodles, Chow Mein. So is it just Chow Mein? Chow Mein. Chow Mein. Yeah, so like fried noodles, literally fried noodles. Um, house or room, uh, gan, gan fong, or okay, I think it's probably like gan fong, like room, or uh, okay. No. Uh, I'll mark that as hard. I don't think I got it wrong per se, but I didn't know the exact, uh, one that that was asking for. The boss, bossy. Bossy. Okay. Da de ma, to have a call, phone call. To cook rice, ju fan. Ju fan. Uh, really, actually, zhen hai. That's the one we just saw. Oh no, sat zoi. Sat zoi. Okay, so so here we have to read a little bit more carefully. This says really, which zhen hai also said, but it really means like actually honest real so in reality which is what satsoi is satsoi just have to be a little bit more careful with the reading of these okay so we saw this one this is something was it gua oh it's chi gua right oh geek sorry geek gua geek gua so I'll mark that again as well uh, again a second time geek gua you kind of have to be a little bit honest with yourself with these. It's easy to cheat yourself and say, well, I sort of knew it. But better to be on the side of seeing it again. Extra practice won't hurt any. Uh, quilt, buy, to meet with. Used before a verb that does not accurately represent what happened. Uh, this one, I don't know. I, I don't know if I've seen this before. Bay. Okay, so this is like makes passive, makes the action passive, like um, something was done to you rather than you doing it. So like you were taught by someone, you were disciplined, you were controlled by someone. This was from a, an old teach yourself dialogue. We didn't see that in Ling's stories. I don't think I don't think so anyway. Uh, something yes sick. Is this the siu ye sick? Siu ye sick. Yeah. So I've seen a lot of different variations on this. I don't know what the most common one is, but um, actually, let me just pull up my Twitter quick quickly here because I had just posted about this a week or two ago. Yeah. So right here. So. This was the version that I saw online. Siu yeah, which is late night snack, and then siu yeah, barbecue. Okay, so this is actually consistent because this is the same siu yeah, barbecue. It's just I'm used to hearing this one siu yeah for like midnight snack or late night snack. And but they are different characters and they do mean different things. So that's that's good to know. 
Uh, the reason I, I brought that up was there are a lot of character variations, and that is kind of a source of frustration for me sometimes, where I, it's hard to know which characters are most commonly used in Cantonese. Uh, but this is actually not an example of that. This is just an example of two different phrases that sort of sound similar, but they're actually completely different phrases with different characters uh, versus something like, I saw the other day that in Glossica, the word for tired, uh, gui, that uses a different character than, uh, than uh, teach yourself does. So like if I look at... Uh, here I look at tired so there's this GUI for tired this was in teach yourself but then Glossica used another version which I, I may not be able to find right away but uh, you just have to trust me on that 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 there's another variation of this that's a different character but it also means tired so those are the kind of things where it's like, okay, a little frustrating, but uh, not going to worry about that too much. Let's just keep it moving, you know, and, and focus on all the progress we're making. So uh, we'll do maybe three or four more minutes of this, and then we'll finish up. So see you, yeah, sick barbecue. Okay. This was the jai, which was the crime, or accused of a crime. Crime, guilt, Sorry. jai. Tao mai fun. Tao mai fun. Tao mai fun. Tao mai fun. Tap jung. Tap jung. Just to concentrate, focus. Tap jung. Gu piu. Stock. Gu piu. Gu piu. Zing hai only. Zing hai. Zing hai. Fo tui ham. Fo tui. Eventually, slowly. Man man. So we learned this today. Man. Man. Uh, this is. Is this guy? Is this street? Oh no. Chung. So guy. I think guy has a different character in the middle. Chung is straight ahead to rush, rush towards, chung, chung, okay, I don't remember what that one's from, sao gong ngai, sao gong ngai, this was the handicraft, arts and crafts, hong, empty, hong, go sing, go sing, this was the singer, uh, this is mm something. Or no, it's ngao pa. Beef steak. Ngao pa. Ngao pa. Hmm. Yeah, I, I still get uh, beef. I, I still get cow and, and year, lean. And even mm, which is like the, I think, afternoon or noon. I keep getting those characters mixed up. Uh, let me know in the comments if, if you guys have any characters that you're struggling with, any characters that are similar or appear similar. I think it'd be good to kind of build up a list of those and maybe make it easier to study them and see the differences. Uh, to put place, is this Fong? Yeah. Fong. Pattern, so Fun Sik. Style, so this is like the style of clothing. You know, the the Sam. Get fun sick, ho ho. So these clothes, the style for these clothes is good. Disam, get fun sick, ho ho. I think something like that would, would work. Fun sick. This was that chung, like to plow forward straight ahead. Chung. Stationary. Man gai. Man gai. Mui chi. Mui chi, every time. Now you gone. This is like bacon. So beef, dried beef. Things like bacon or jerky. Yeah. No you gone. No you gone. Mui yat. Mui yat every day. Mui yat. 
And uh, what was that? Ngao Pa Beefsteak? Ngao Pa. Okay. And last one we'll end with today, Zhan Hai. So this was like, of course, like really, Zhan Hai. Zhan Hai. Okay, great. So thanks again for joining me. This is our first stream of the new year. I'm really excited. Uh, uh, let's keep it going. Let's let's keep doing these every week. Like I said, I'm, I'm going to try to start putting out other videos in addition to the stream. Um, if you're watching this and you have any ideas for uh, either topics you want to just uh, want me to cover or anything that you're struggling with that you could see a, use a video for, um, you know, like I said at the, the beginning of these streams, I'm I'm looking to just kind of put out what I'm studying out there and if anyone uh, can benefit from this that'd be great and we can sort of make make progress together on this so um, again thanks for watching and uh, we'll check in again with you next week this time same time again next week next Sunday 7 p.m. central uh, thanks again bye